Hey guys, welcome back. It's your boy Original K. Welcome back to some more until dawn. A Lego. <laughs> I'm a bit hyper today. We're in the basement and we're looking for some mystery goals. Can we take that baseball bat that we found back last time? And PS, if I'm screaming at you guys, I gotta say this all the time for every video. If I scream at you guys, I'm so sorry. But where's the baseball bat? Where's that baseball bat? I'll be somebody ass. Somebody gonna get fucked up. It's there. Why can't I take the baseball bat? I some bullshit. But yeah, holidays are over. Back to school time, bitches. <laughs> I get to play games. <laughs> oh shit! Fuck! What the fuck? Oh fuck this shit! What the hell? Oh fuck! Keep out strangers! Hey. What? Hey. What the hell? Oh, you just got mucked. Fucking prick. What? <laughs> Suck nice. your mum, cuz. What, but why would you do that? There's all this cool old movie crap down here. What was I? Was I not supposed to take advantage of the opportunity? Are you? Are you serious? Were you in on this, putz? <laughs> no, but I, I wish I was. That was too good. I'm ready to admit that your dumb little prank may have a slight whiff of humor. Joke master. Well, I, I said nothing about jokes. I said your prank, which was dumb. Holy crap, you were scared. Admit it. I was not. Come on, you totally pissed yourself. Josh. What in God's name are you wearing? I found my true calling. Mm -hmm. Please tell me you're gonna take a vow of silence. <laughs> okay, okay, did you at least find the thingy? Oy, 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 oy. Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. You know what, you know what, no, no. I've just been through enough spooking for one night, okay? I see a hot bath in my crystal ball, mm. all right? So have fun. Oh, but watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Okay. Hello, Earth to Matt. You gonna come with me to get my bag? Yeah. Yeah, I'm coming. Oh, welcome back. <laughs> But that dude was a prick. Chris is a dick. He scared the shit out of me. Like, this game is fucking my man. But guys, a heads up, my family's downstairs and they're watching TV so you could hear a bit of their movie and the screaming and shit. So if there's any noise, I do apologize. <laughs> Let's look at more of these totems, which, you know, this is yellow. Ooh, Ooh somebody gonna get fucked up. Like just to get your hand caught in a bear trap, like really ah! ah! It looks painful as fuck. Okay. Let's play the video because usually you always get a video here we did. Sometime after the prospectors and driven mad murderers. Human flesh. What I think is that this mansion that's built here, I think it was built like on top of like a graveyard or something like that. Usually, you know, like what they mean, what like the mythologies and mythological, mythology, 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 is that it? I don't know. <laughs> but like the mythology is like you should never bury a house on top of like a graveyard or something. I think like the mine, a lot of people died there and the house like, you know, like a grave and all this shit. So like, I think Warm, things are gonna happen. Why, thank you, <laughs> things sir. are going to happen. And when you come to look at my, these guys on like on a on a mountainside somewhere in the middle of nowhere, like that is crazy as fuck. Um, wait, do I talk to her? Let me see if I can look through here. Come on, come on. That's where they were standing. Who's the deer? Oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? See that deer just looked straight at me. It looked at me like he gonna die. 
You gonna die, bitch. That's all she looked at me and said. You gonna die today. But yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed your holidays. I know not everybody's back to school yet, but I hope you guys enjoyed it. Hey, M. Yeah? Feeling a little better now? Say what? That was a nasty fight. The further we get from Jessica, the better I feel. I just want you to relax. You know? Have a good time. I'll relax when everyone else relaxes. But thanks for trying. Oh, my skin is still crawling from when they walk on the snow, man. It's so, oh, I hate the feel of people walking in deep snow. It's so gross. But I, I wish this guy would realize that, you know, that his girlfriend doesn't oh. fuck. Okay. All right. It's not being a chicken shit, man. It's just the lights. What is that flashing lights over there? What is that? I wonder what that is. Ah, oh, deep snow walk. Oh, that's so horrible. But I do wish I never get to talk. This is so horrible. Hey, doofus, and... come this way. You uh, trying to get me somewhere private? Why don't you uh, come find out? She gonna get us both killed, you bitch ass. Let's turn around. Let's go back. Like, the thing that's so crazy is the in-game dialogue. Yeah? Thanks for helping me find my bag. I know I can be a little high-maintenance. It's no problem. But you gotta remember, there's more to this guy than just being a lean, mean, luggage-lifting machine. You gonna back that up? All day. <laughs> what? All day. <laughs> Wait, what does that mean? Like, all day long. I was being, like, sexy. <laughs> like, I think the in-game dialogue is so cheesy at times. Ah, oh, we're being stalked. Why the fuck are we being stalked again? Who is this prick? Like, breathing hard and everything as well. But like the in-game dialogue just hit you out of nowhere and it's so hard to commentate because I went to just, you know, speak in the be cut off show is pretty hard. Huh. Cool. Oh, it's so pretty out here tonight. Wow. Yeah. It's so nice to be here with you, muscle man. Uh, I'm not all muscle. <laughs> There are some brains in here too. Well, you got enough brains to like me, so let's see that brawn. You ever done it outside before? Outside of what? My car. I like your car. Roomy. This ain't roomy enough for you? It's all about porn. This game's literally all about porn, isn't it? Uh, you know what? Maybe there's a better spot. Does this spot start with a G? There are lots of places out here. I already started clearing this all for us. Like a gentleman. Well, come on, let's look around. Okay, so I'm not clearing the table. Wait, can I clear the table even more? Or I want to have if I just keep clearing the table. Oh, well, look at that. Hey. What the hell, Em? Don't be jealous. Why would you take me here? Make me feel like a chump. Don't be so sensitive. I'm here with you right now. Mike's the chump. Okay, maybe chump isn't the right word. What is? Lucky. Hmm. You got in there. Oh, first base. Got that first base kiss. Obviously, you know how we do play a pimp, pimp. You know how we do <laughs> Okay, I have to, like, wait, we just walk and then talk, then walk and then talk. It's so important in the bag, anyways. It's just my undies. The lacy ones. Well, hell, we don't need those. You don't want me to model them for you? I'm just gonna rip them off, anyways. Maybe I wanna show them off. Puts me in a generous mood. Let's go get them. 
So we're gonna get down and day. I hope you little kids watching this don't be picking this shit up. There's junk that out there somewhere. But all the player, all the players out there, <laughs> put them deuces up. But this game, uh, oh my god, we're gonna talk again. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, this is, oh, that's the light that keeps flashing. So which way do we go? This way, that's gonna get us all killed. This way, that's gonna get us all killed. I don't know. So does this like choose between life and death? They always say go, like yesterday I was reading something. This is ironical. I was reading something yesterday. They said, if you go left, you stand out from the crowd. But if, if you go right, that's what like everybody else does. So like, I'll go left. Let's see what happens. Like, this game makes you do a lot of decisions, as well, that, like, the choices you make could be your own. madam. Thank you. Oh my, very impressive. What was that? Uh, I'm not sure. Probably just an animal. Do not like. Yeah, I just got us all killed. I am sorry, guys. If I do die, I am so sorry. And, yeah. My bad. <laughs> but I wonder why, like, these guys will carry on going. Like, if you heard, like, a strange noise and all this shit, I'd pretty much run back. To go back. Oh, look at the, look at the, their footprints come out of the snow before they even step up. <laughs> what a fail. That, ooh, that pig got hey. fucked up. What the hell? Somebody made a snowman. Uh, that was not there before. Is that a note? Welcome back. Oh. Uh. Let's read what does it say? Where is it? Where is it? Um I welcome back no pen to pig's head, the paper says the penitentiary. Oh my northern okay. It's gotta be Chris. Or Josh. They're just trying to mess with us. Kind of uncool, guys. I don't like this. Me neither. Oh! Matt! What the hell's going on? What the hell did this? You know, I'm kind of not giving a shit about my panties anymore. I kind of just want to split. Agreed. Oh, we're back to this prick. Alright, go on, fucking sit down, you faggot. I would like to understand your feelings toward people of fear, isolation, loneliness. Do you share this fear? <sighs> yes, I do. Is that so? Because that's not reflected in the way you are playing your game. Now, is it? Let us investigate your feelings toward other people in greater depth. What you value, what you respect in yourself and others. Which would you say was most important in a person, loyalty or honesty? Hmm. Well, loyalty is a person that, but I, I don't know if I'm like, Honesty, someone can still lie to you because well, it's better for someone to be truthful to you. But that's like an even question. What the hell? Oh, oh, oh. Uh, I would say loyalty. Oh, is it honesty? Ah, this is a hard question. Ah, shit. I say loyalty. So you would tell a lie in order to be loyal to a friend, okay. And what about loyalty versus charity? Oh man. Like this guy, I don't know what is this guy? Like he there's some reason he's here. There's like this there has to be a reason. And look at that tarantula. Holy it's alive. Fuck. Uh 
I'll, I'll have to give. I'll have to give. Such a giving and caring person. Very nice. Well, once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. Today is the one-year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy of Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together, and I'm thinking of them. Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. Boom. Butterfly effect. Excuse me? Did you say something? Oh, did you not hear me? Was your sluttiness... Stop it! Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah. Yeah, all right. Did you hear that? What in God's name are you wearing? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. Oh, watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Well, that's how it's gonna be. Yes? <coughs> Jess! So, it says here, to communicate with the spirit world, you must free your mind of all preconceptions, drop all inhibitions, and generally give yourself over entirely to the will of others, sublimating your every desire to the whims of the spirit master, which is me. It doesn't say that. And all present will remove their garments at my sole discretion. Chris, come on, this is serious. <laughs> oh, I'm deadly serious. <laughs> oh, shush it. Let's try this. Yes, please. OK, then. Let's see what happens. Ashley, since you're a recent convert, why don't you be our medium for today? Well, guys, when we'll come back, we'll carry on with more of the isolation. Woo! Stay original, stay safe!